what's going on everybody hey we're here with another tutorial today we're going to install ftpd to our ds so that we can transfer files over the wi-fi without having to take out the sd card or turn it off which for some people would find fairly convenient so we're going to go ahead and take out our sd card plug it into the computer as usual we're going to open up a new window on your web browser whatever choice that may be and you're gonna go ahead and copy and paste the link in the description it's going to take you to a mega dot link and you just click download and wait for it to download and here I'm gonna save it into a new folder created already once it's done you're gonna click show in folder so you can see it and I'm going to bring my 3ds card window here so we're just gonna go ahead and drag and drop into our CIA's folder gonna copy over fairly quick it's a small file and we're gonna remove our SD card from the computer and put it back into the DS to install since it is a CIA file you're going to go ahead and install it with the FBI application that I previously showed on this channel which you can click on the link in the corner of this video to check that out Here we're booting and we look for our FBI application, which mine is right over here. And within the FBI menu, we're going to go to our RSD card and CIA, and there's our folder. And I like to install and delete the CIA because typically after I install it, I usually don't need it anymore. And once it's done, we're going to go ahead and click the home button to go back to the home screen. Our Wii is going to tell us that we just got a new... And we're going to go ahead and launch it. It's okay to close FBI's and we're done with it. And here we are inside FTPD. Now, the, what you're going to have to look for is that over here on the top in this white text, you're going to have what's called your IP number. And yours will be different than mine, so don't go putting this into your application here, otherwise it's not going to work. And we're going to go ahead and uh, open up a program called FileZilla, which I'll also have in the description below. The white IP address, you're going to type in over here at the top. You're going to type in the IP address in one spot. And then the numbers after the colon, after the two dots, are going to go all the way at the end on the port section. Once you type that in, you can go ahead and click Quick Connect to connect quickly. When this error comes up, click yes and allow and here on the right you can see our 3ds file system so I'm going to go ahead and look for the CIA file that I want to install I'm going to go ahead and find it I go here folder and then you can see here actually uploading to the DS obviously you're gonna have to be on Wi-Fi for this to work if you don't have Wi-Fi you cannot transfer this way and once it's done you'll get a little notification on the side and once everything is done you can just close out of everything 
and to exit FTP you just click the home button as usual, close the application, and when we're installing a CIA file, we're going to go ahead and go to FBI, again navigate to SD card and our CIA folder, you can see that the theme is right there, I'm going to install and delete CIA since that's my preference. Done right here, we're gonna go ahead and click OK and get the home button to go back to the home screen. We'll get our new software notification with our little present. We click open, and as you could see, the game is installed right there, ready to launch. We just click A to launch it, and in just a few minutes, you'll be in the experience. Now obviously transferring over Wi-Fi is a little bit slower than transferring directly to the SD card is if you insert it into your computer, but this is meant to be more of a convenient way for people that don't want to take out the SD card, or for example if you have the new 3DS XL which requires you to take off screws and take off the back in order to put in the SD card into the computer, no one wants to do that. So with this method I hope that it conveniences you a little bit more so if you like this video thumb it up if not there's that other button comment and subscribe for more videos like this and i'll catch you in the next one